just couldn't wait until morning. Let's go. Yes! Finally five stars. Ascension. Let's go. Let's ascend this baby. All right, you guys caught me. I was caught on camera. I couldn't wait last night. I had to upgrade Armager to five stars. He, it was needed for battles, plus it was needed for one of the events where we needed those tournament points to help ourselves place higher in the event. Also, the clan versus clan tournament is finished. We need to see what went on here and how well our brand new clan dominated the competition. And look at this. I actually placed fourth in the champion training tournament. That's why we were doing this last night. We had to get the upgrade in while we were getting the rewards for it. So I'm actually not so mad that I was caught on the hidden camera. But was it really hidden? What's going on guys? My name is Echo. Welcome back to Raid Shadow Legends where today we got some big upgrades. The new grind continues and of course, we have to see how well we did with our clan. Before we go any further, I want to thank you guys for following me on the journey. We've had so many comments come through that are just loving the content like this one. From the head down, you're doing a great job at standing out in the community, not being exactly like other content creators. Well done. I like most of the other's content too, but it's cool to see something a little different. And man, that is exactly what we're going for here. Something a little bit different than everybody else. I'm glad that the community and that the head down has uh, noticed that and is enjoying it. It's, it's just a, it's a fresh feeling. We always feature community comments here. So if you're active in the comments section, hopefully you'll get your debut one of these days. And if you've never played Raid Shadow Legends, consider utilizing my QR code or my link in the description of this video. It's going to get you a free champion and there's no better time to raid than right now. Because you can get two free legendary champions if you're new to the game right now. I wish I had took advantage of that offer back in the day. But not only that, my friends, it also directly supports me here on the channel. So I deeply appreciate anyone that uses that link shares it with family members give it to grandma maybe the dog needs to play a little bit of raid either way send out the code and subscribe to the channel to follow me on the journey but what's going on today in raid first of all as you can see we just logged in six gen i legit slept last night i think three and a half hours yeah this is becoming a problem so let's get the day started let's begin things up right here what's going on? are we gonna get lucky in the market Nope, diddly nope, nope, nothing. Clan versus clan, though. Did we just win some gear? Cha-ching, let's go. We're gonna claim all this. We received it. That's nice. Well, that's quite nice now, isn't it? We're gonna claim these rewards just like that and personal rewards. Ooh. Oh, I only got to milestone 130 energy, but you know what? That's 30 more energy for me. We'll take that all day long. This will continuously progress as the clan grows. And you're wondering about the clan. You're like, Echo, what is this clan if you've never been here? Well, the clan is Echo Raid, of course. And the clan leader is me, Echo Gaming Raid. All makes good sense now, doesn't it? Home of Echo Raid Shadow Legends on YouTube. Required to be active daily to participate or end participate in clan events. And some of our member, oh, we could check in. Bink. Some of our members are as featured. We could scroll on through. Remember, you start getting that different color here in the zone. That means you're not playing enough, boys and girls, and anyone else, because we have applicants waiting to come on in, and if spots open up, you will be allowed to join, because we are an ever-growing family. Also, by the way, we have this dot over here. We got some Plarium uh, rewards. What exactly do we have here? A champion that I could collect? Is this something that I should do? I, I do have the energy, so we will -dink, grab the energy, which is great. Oh, we're not even here for the champion yet. We need to get all the way. This is, this is like... This is forever. Is she even any good? Is this champion one that I should desire or one that is okay to really not grind for? Let me know down below. And speaking of down below, another comment that we have from the community is REJN Cinema 4295 saying, Katoon is worth six stars as soon as possible. Smiley face. I agree. Katoon is on my list. We also, I mean, obviously we have Armager. We have to get Armager up to level. We did a little grinding with him. He's up to 12, but he's going to get there. He is five stars right now. We also want to get up Katoon. 
we want to work on Tyrell. But before that, I think the priority is going to be our next upgrade. The new grind beginning now is to get Rathalos Blademaster to six stars and to ascend him as needed. All right. Can he get ascended right now? Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Let's do this right now. Let's go with the ascension right here. Rathalos Blade Master. Five stars. Ascended two times. Love that. Beautiful. We are going to actually work on getting him to six, as I mentioned. And I'm actually content with Armager sitting at five stars a little bit longer. I think it's more important for me to get Rathalos up before that. As you recall, Geomancer is six stars. We're getting him up to level. We have Kale up to six. And you know what? Another comment actually made me think of something. When we get him to six stars, well, why don't we jump to the comment? The comment was from Sam Wu. He says, I've been playing since 2019, and I must say it's so refreshing and quite a nostalgia trip watching someone start fresh. You're getting some great suggestions here already, so I'll just mention that you should keep an eye on your upcoming missions and perhaps adjust your areas of focus accordingly. Well, that's funny because we did actually do missions and realize that we were wasting our missions in yesterday's video, which is right here. Well, you can't click it but it's on the main page of the channel. But we have been getting back into and grinding and focusing on missions. We could go so far in this and we will continue to do so, just not today, because today's for something new. But I appreciate the guidance there. What I was trying to speak on though was, once we get Rathalos Blademaster up to level, if you see over here in upgrade level, we do have this barrel. See this barrel right here? That is gonna take Rathalos from six stars level one to six stars level 60. That barrel has Rathalos name all over it. That is not an M on it. So what's going on with these tournaments? How did the tournament placement actually turn out for me specifically? Champion training tournament. Well, we did get the shard. That was our goal right there, right? But we, we were inched out of third place by the Snake 88, earning the name the Snake. We at least get a chest in one of these uppity doodah days. So we're gonna claim all right there. We, we worked hard. We worked hard, um, but we didn't quite get it down. Now, Classic Arena Takedown is going on right now. We don't have anything in here, so this is clearly something that we're gonna be doing today. What I'll probably do is, why don't we start it out right now, right? While, while things are fresh, we're gonna start this out because then we can get a, maybe a, a refresh of opponents by the end of the video because we wanna get and see how much we can progress through this because we wanna place in everything. We really wanna make some placements here. And we got Plagued F2P, one of my clanmates. Haha, -ha, right back to the grind, but T dot dot dot. What do you think he actually said? All right, we're going to do maybe five of these and then move on out. Moving on out. Forge Pass weekly thing completed. That's fantastic. And this is going to be very easy. Kale is going to nuke everyone. Is, is she going to go? Why is there always like one that doesn't go down? What's going on here? There's like geese outside. A whole bunch of geese just landed out there. This is why I need the echo cam. Did it refresh me? No, we have one more right here and then it'll refresh itself. I do think it charges me though for the refresh. Again, we don't care about placements. We don't care how good we are in the arena. All we care about is essentially getting the rewards that we can get from arena focused events. That's what I'm doing right here, right now. You know what we have to do for the clan? We need to go in over here to clan bosses. The Hydra is open again for us. We, we kind of featured that already. We got some rewards. We're going to claim that bad boy. Grab the chests, two of them. We're going to claim this bad boy. Claim, claim. Oh, wait a second. Are these done already? I can't, can I do a battle here? I believe that means that they're done. There's no HP. Well, we could do it on hard. Hard, I think quick battle is not an option. We got to actually sit in here with our battle. What's the guess in the comments right now below? Let me know what is your guess how much damage can I do on this open-bellied beast? What do you think? A million damage, just hitting that right there, okay. Now, the champion that we focused on here today, the one, the upgrade that we did and the ascension that we got, well, he's not even really being used in this. So we're not gonna see much of a difference from our prior attacks. I would love it if I can get enough damage so I could do this on like auto or quick so that it can get done really fast. But it's not bad to watch the graphics and the animations from time to time. Appreciate what we have here from Raid Shadow Legends. Uh oh, Rathalos Blademaster is stunned. Wake up, wake up, little Susie, wake up. All right, now he's down. 
There's no more way to get up from that. All right, he's going to hit 3 million damage. I believe 3.5 million is where we sat before. Let's see if we can, if we can surpass that. I need a couple of big nukes from Kale right here. 3.5, we got that. Okay, cool. Can we maybe push it to 4? Can we get 4 million damage? Going once. Going twice. 4 million. Just about. One more shot from Kale. We hit 4. And Kale's about to go night to night. Yeah. Right on cue. All right. That's fine, though. That's fine. We're going to skip through this. Do we want to try it on Brutal or Nightmare or Ultra Nightmare? I don't think I can. I could go on Brutal, though. I've never done it on Brutal before. We ain't never done Brutal, and I get the feeling I'm going to get a th oh, um, 1 million damage. 1 million damage is my guess. Wow. We are going to hit a million damage. Whoa. He hits hard, though. Again, we're doing this for the good of the clan. For the clan. And we're also doing it for those chest rewards, let's be honest. Tyrell goes down, but we still have Rathalos up going strong. We got the HP burn going on. Kale coming in with his nuke. Rathalos with the belly spike again. It's down to Geomancer and Kale getting on the burn, dropping the poison on him, and now is a big strike from the big beast. And Kale is still up. 2.7 million damage? I can't believe this. I know, you guys may be putting out 60 million plus damage, but not me, so I'm happy when I can pull in 3 million damage? Wow, an RGB Tony saying, good work in clan versus clan, guys. We crushed it. Also, good work to me on Brutal, 3.63 million. I'm proud of that. So, the new grind all starts now. And that grind is getting Rathalos up to six stars. What do we need to do this? In the tavern, when we go to upgrade a rank, you realize we have no five-star food. Literally, not a nothing none. So we need to get our five-star food grind on. To do this, we're gonna be hitting up the campaign, baby. And where do we like to campaign? We like to campaign on stage, what stage is this? 12-3, yes, 12-3 it is. And I am gonna go in here, with, and we have a lot of food too, because we look at all these twos. Man, this, there must be a better way. We have a four, we could get this up, that could be used as food, level 40, that's good. We have some two stars that have a little grind on them, so we'll use this guy. Wait, am I, what? What difficulty is this on? I'm sorry. We're not doing it on normal. We're doing it on brutal. But first, before we even do, messing this up completely, we need to use our XP. XP, collect, one day. Bam! Go! Now! We gotta get it in. We, every second counts. We're going to the campaign. We're on brutal. We're coming on over here. We're going on stage three. Yes, and here it goes. So, oh God, now I gotta find these guys again. All right. Eight energy being used, and the grind has begun. How many days of grinding is it gonna take for us to actually get Rathalos Blade Master to max? I do have some three star chickens too. I wonder what we can get to, I wonder if we can get anything to five right now. Good thing is we have Kale, he's leading the way. Is he gonna, he's not gonna. What? I spoke too soon. Let's do that again. Yeah, that was a little freaky that we lost. Oh, oh, good. More champions. We need more for sure. All right, let's um, let's go to Bastion and let's let's mess around the tavern a little bit here. Why don't we? We're gonna go to upgrade rank. What kind of ranks can we upgrade? We have here. We can drop two one stars, two two stars in them right there. So now he's up to three. Now we do have. This is what I want to see. We do have three star food. So if I want to get rid of him, do we have any four stars that could go up to five? She's a four star. And check this out, we actually have, we can have one five star to start. We got a chicken, a chicken. We got him, I don't care if we sacrifice him. One grind at a time, okay? And we got her. So we actually have one five star champion. So when we want to go over here and we want to go upgrade rank and we go Rathalos, we have one. That's actually a better start than I had anticipated today to go with. So now we need to get more of these five star foods. We're going back in on stage three. We're going on in and we're getting more grinding. I don't know, why not? Maybe this will work out. K money, let's, let's go K money. Oh God, he's gonna lose again? He is. Oh no, he's not. He, okay, we're good. Woo, he gets me worried now sometimes this guy. He gets me worried. Look, we're getting the experience. What I need to do is I need to get these like up to four or something and then just auto throughout the day because then I'll be able to get up. If I could get one piece of food to level five a day, I feel like that's an attainable grind. That's, that's fair for me to try and do, right? Plus, we can't forget, we also need to go ahead and do our missions. 
because that's going to give us more of the double XP. We shouldn't do this without double XP. So maybe I'll wait until I get double XP rewards and then I'll go in and do these types of things. We'll get the double XP rewards from grinding missions. Once we get a double XP, then we'll make a day focused on grinding with that XP. I think that's smart. That's wise of me. Let's get another one going and uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do some Twitter research and see what's being said by Raid on the Twitter or the X. What is it even called now? Is it really called X? Well, it looks like we do have a little bit of Twitter news and it's an interactive one. First of all, I'm gonna drop my heart on it and I'm gonna, and let's read it together. Raiders, the St. Valentine's Day is getting closer and we wanna know who your favorite couple is in Raid. Every day you'll see a new round with a poll here on Twitter. So get ready to vote. Here comes the first one. Kale and Elaine or Gaelic and, I really like Gaelic and Zargla. Zarga, Zargala. Kale's my boy, but we're voting Gaelic. We gotta go Gaelic. I think they're a cute couple, all right? They're just cute together. Oh, and we got a little bit of a trailer going on. The new fragment exchange feature will allow you to swap unspent champion fragments for exchange points and receive various goodies in return. Most importantly, you can gather fragments for High Mother, Maud, a powerful legendary champion who can't be recruited anywhere else. Let's dive in and take a look at this trailer and uh, a listen. Uh, this is pretty cool. I actually love it. I, I just love that they're always bringing new stuff to raid. I know the community was pretty hyped about this. So yeah, big news. Big news. Breaking it here. Although it's probably been broken on every other raid channel already. Doing it my way. All right. Looks like we, uh, we max leveled them. Let's go. That was easy. We got to go here to Bastion and we got to rank them up because that is our focus, boys. We are focusing on these two. Bing, bing. I... I I'm not caring about the synergizing stuff right now. That is just too much. Oh, we got the three stars, chickens too, good. And Armager's good, and now we have, who is this? Pit Spawn, huh? Pit Spawn, we'll get his rank up, come on. Let's rank you up, rank you up. Getting stronger. All right, and then you know what it's back to? We should go into the arena and use a couple more, more tokens. We need to use four more so that we can then use that that satchel of coinage before they go away. They're, they're away in 16 minutes. Let's get the wins. We need four wins and then we'll use the coinage because we don't waste. You can't waste on an account when you need to min max every single thing inside of the account. You know, there's a reason I don't record these videos when my kids are home. They'd be like, what the heck is wrong with my dad? You're not gonna believe this. There are about 50 geese on my front lawn. Let me get you a picture. That's a lot of geese, and that's what I have to deal with here. You have a little little body of water, and you gotta deal with creatures like that. And they poop a lot. That's the issue. All right, we're out of our coinage, so let's actually come on over, and we're gonna utilize it. We were min-maxing our resources. Everything else has some hours. There's another one that doesn't have a lot of time, so boom, we'll collect that. Boom, we got some. Did we, did we advance ourselves something? Okay, 32, we'll get there. We'll get there. I bet you I could actually place pretty well on this. With all the tokens that I have, I could probably max that out. But we are back and we're going to, we are focused on what we need to do here. Now, the cool thing is all these champions right above my head, we get a lot of them. We get a lot of these. So I could use them as food, which has actually been quite uh, beneficial for me. And we're going to be doing a bunch of the arena. I want to place in the arena tournament. I want to level up food. We got one piece of five star food today. A little bit of a cheap way. We had a bunch of stuff that was just laying around that we were able to combine and make into a five star champ, which is a beautiful start. We only need four more. Goal is that by tomorrow I have at least one. Just casually grinding these champions throughout the day, getting them up. I'm gonna be using a lot more of the two star champions because 
well, why not? We also have this XP boost going on for 24 hours. We have a bunch of energy. We may as well take advantage of that. That's the plan. Now I'm gonna go outside with a baseball and I'm gonna get rid of all those geese because I don't want them pooping by my pond. Have a great day, guys. As you guys can see, the geese are all gone. We got rid of them. Now we're going back from our geese chasing mission. The animals that got the work done. A little bit of an inside look. <laughs>